So we're gonna go for a little drive in the F100, Crown Hick. One thing we did do was add shoulder belts. One of the first things I did when I built this before we took it on its first trip. Although now it's trapped me in. There we go. So what I love about this truck is driving it, aside from, you know, the obvious quirks of an old truck with the, the wind noise around the seals and, you know, the rattles and that sort of thing. It really feels like you're driving a somewhat modern car. You know, you got rocket pinion steering, you got power steering, power brakes, four wheel discs, fuel injection. The thing starts right up every time. It cruises along comfortably on the highway. Um, it's effortless to drive on the back roads. You, you still got a giant steering wheel, even though you got power steering and everything. Um, you know, you're, you're not setting any speed records by any means. It's only 250 horsepower from the stock crown bit 4.6. Term, it'd be nice to do a 5 0 swap, you know, same architecture, mod motor family, so it'd be an easy, easy swap into this platform. Uh, gain a lot of power. Uh, you know, the, the hot rod garage, their version of it, they supercharge with some triple blower. But for my goals for this project, just to make a you know, a 68 F100 that bruises like a, a more modern car. This does everything I wanted to do. Uh, you know, we did power tour with it in 18. We did the Lemons uh, retreat from Moscow, right, Moscow rally in 17. You know, that we drove it all the way up to Niagara Falls, down to Birmingham, Alabama. And uh, the thing did great, never skipped a beat. And I uh, wouldn't hesitate to hop this thing, drive cross country with it yet. So it really is a joy to drive. Uh, it's been one of my favorite project trucks. You know, the seat's got a little bounce to it. Kind of, you float around it, slide across the bench seat. Still feels like you're driving an old truck, but that's what makes it great, in my opinion. Yeah. 
at the the Blues Brothers jokes, uh, cop motor, cop tires, cop brakes, and uh, you know this thing had a lot of good stuff on it to begin with. So B71 really is a great platform. Well, I hope you enjoyed the ride. Uh, if you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe, and maybe we can get some better audio equipment. So next time it'll be a little bit better.